And that guy, Oops, I'm fine. the wolf man, I'm, I'm he's fine. fine. Yeah, yeah he's fine. nothing happened. We're good. Glad that you're here. Start recording. Start recording. It's time for us to start recording. <laughs> Someone said I could be a one-man band, so I'm working on it. But are you men? Were you saying nope, not today to my song? <laughs> you know, that's not a possibility, right? Oh, you wore the shirt. It was ironical. Ironical. Ironic is, is what works. Is it? All right. So it's good to be back with you guys. Um, every Friday morning, you know that I wake up, if you watch our channel, and I eagerly await Tommy's release. Um, actually, late last night, um i don't know one or two i was looking in the morning Great. yeah not there yet i think it's five central time 5 a.m but anyway regardless if we were not a duo i would be here at 5 a.m every friday would you, would you? i yeah. would yeah between, you know between like sleeping with your mouth open <laughs> Oh, uh, so uh, today I was very surprised. I knew that Tommy was going to use a banjo, but I had no idea he that John Denver was even on his radar. John Denver uh, died a number of years ago, right? Yeah, but I mean, this is a song that we all sang as kids. We sang it in Japan. Yeah. They loved it. Wolfman's band had to go over to Japan for a month, and that was the song that they always wanted to hear. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> and now I can find them. They were beautiful people. But they, they liked the country music. To, but they loved country. We were a country band that played rock and roll, really. <laughs> hey, Pop, what's going on? And then our lead singer in the band was like probably six, six and a half, six, six, six. Mm. And he towered over everybody in the band, but especially most of the Japanese are very short people. Yeah, the, yeah they're not people as tall as their uh, horses. <laughs> the people in the Netherlands are oh, yeah. really tall. Yeah. I don't know about Sweden. Um, um, maybe you could tell us. Do you have yeah. stretch machine when you leave yeah. a certain... Are you tall <laughs> or are you short or are you tall. regular? <laughs> tall, <laughs> short, or regular? Please Medium. check one. Do you think I should put a little survey out to our sure. Swedish friends? Are sure. you check tall, check short, check regular, medium, check shut up? We're not going to tell you how back. tall we are. <laughs> None of your business, you None of your business, right? So I am happy because uh, yeah. this is just always a treat for me on Friday. Just I need it, and it's awesome. I can get my headphones on. There we go. Country roads take me home to the place. Sorry, why are you attacking me? What have I done? All right, we're ready. excited. Virginia, Blue Ridge Mountains, Shenandoah River. Life is older, older than the trees, younger than the mountains, growing like a breeze. Country roads take me home. Take me home. 
Wait, what's that? Wait, what's that? What a nice little ending. Very nice. Okay. Yeah. Um, first thing I want to say is, Tommy, I've been to West Virginia. Guys, right do your here, mom a favor there. this year by getting her a unique gift that she'll player. treasure forever. I have to talk. I don't know. What movie is on now? Well, Go ahead. Anyway, uh, I'll yeah, I've been up there. It's beautiful many it times. Uh, just because I want you to know that um, I I am uh, something special. <laughs> I went there. Okay. You've been there Lots you've of been, people been there. You've been to, to West Virginia? <laughs> the one place in West Virginia you go to, the Pizza Hut? No. And, uh, really? I like West Virginia. It was, yeah. very, it was beautiful, and people there were very laid back yeah and they i really were um years ago uh we got pulled over my first husband and i uh when we were driving through west virginia and i was like oh damn and we had three kids in the back and um the cop came up and i i looked like this out the window and i said i told him to slow down officer but he wouldn't <laughs> listen and the nice. policeman thought oh, he's henpecked yeah. So. Uh, so we'll let him go and didn't give him a ticket. Nice. It's like, I feel bad enough for you with your wife. <laughs> but I only did that for a show. I don't, you know, so anyway. Well, I, um, I, uh, I like the song a lot. And, and secretly, even when I was long hair head banger, I like the song. I've always liked yeah. the song. I was like the structure. It's very simple. I love the bridge. Uh, now he did the bridge a little different way. He really transposed it. Mm -hmm. uh, John, John Dipper did not, but he transposed it up and made it made his voice shine a little bit. The fact that he can really play banjo, I have a banjo hanging on the wall that I've never even taken down. I have finger beats and stuff. He can learn anything in yeah, things. Strings, you yeah. just hand him a hurdy gurdy, and he just like, oh okay, I've never seen one before, but I want a hurdy gurdy, just that one. I know. Just say the name hurdy gurdy. So I want to know who this was a tribute to. I don't know if it's like his granddad or whoever, who yeah, the man yeah, was. Yeah, he had a picture and the mm -hmm. candles around it. Mm -hmm. So the very uh, first third was a uh, more somber like remembrance. Yeah. And then he went into the banjo mm -hmm. with the guitar. Mm -hmm. like and that. only guitar, a little more banjo, only guitar. So all of the musical instruments and the arrangement the harmonies there was one harmony that he it was amazing yeah. and um the uh bagpipes at the beginning just right at the beginning which you could tell okay that's going to make it a tribute to somebody yeah. who's passed because yeah. those are always yeah those that are i associate them with yeah things that they the one thing about Tommy, besides the fact he's uber talented, is that he he doesn't appear to take himself, at least on his videos, he doesn't take himself seriously. He's very good. He knows he is. He It doesn't feel to me like he's trying to show. That no, he's, he's not showing talent. off. He's yeah. having fun and saying, you know, here's he's just great music. Yeah. And I thought about that this morning. I was like, I got up after my prayer time and was thinking about Tommy and um <laughs> I was. Where was, was I in any of your thoughts anywhere other than he's still sleeping, that bastard? <laughs> You're in my prayer time. What's wrong with you? Okay, so anyway, what was I thinking about? Thinking about Tommy, of course. First thing you thought about when you got out of bed after your prayer time was Tommy, remember? Yes, but I was thinking something about him, and now I've lost the lost I'm the so thought. sorry that you've lost your lover's thought. You know, that's really annoying when you do that. I, do. I love it, though. He's a he's a boy to me. I could be he's, his mother. He's, he's about five feet taller than you are. <laughs> Is he, he 11 boy. feet tall? He's very no, tall. No, wait, 12, 12 feet. No. When he, was, when he played with Sauton, and, and what's his name from Germany? He's so short. And he would he would settle way off to the side, 
So Joaquin, he wouldn't like show up, Joaquin. Oh, Joaquin. Joaquin. Yeah, he, yeah, he is. He is smaller than Tommy. Yeah. A lot smaller than Tommy. Uh, I wouldn't call him Sorry, short, yeah. but close enough. Yeah, compared to Tommy. I think Tommy's six five. Pretty tall. I'm six foot. Mm -hmm. Maybe he just someone's playing drums back right here. I mean, Buster's behind the drums. Uh, suddenly, I heard something. I don't know if you guys could hear it from G here. G group, just playing. What's sick? I mean, we could try to like take some tape or something and put it around his paw with oh, the drumstick love that. out, and then set him up there as best as possible, like a show pony, and put him on our channel. <laughs> he would absolutely love that. I'm not your show pony. <laughs> I thought it was great. And oh, I know what I was thinking about him this morning is that if he took himself really seriously and he was not so welcoming and warm, and I feel this way about Floor too, it wouldn't be the same. I would like the music, but there'd be like a disconnect. And there's the way that they are so gentle and humble and how they express themselves i don't know it um, makes I, a difference i'm willing for people to disagree with me absolutely but <clears throat> if he didn't have <clears throat> sorry guys if he didn't have the humility and playfulness it would be eddie van halen because to me i remember when van halen first came out with david lee roth and eddie van halen's brother um that they were they were to me just to, maybe just to me i don't know but they were very haughty and they were they could play and knew it <clears throat> and a certain sound coming out of the 80s that everybody loved, right? And so I think of Tommy, for me, when you were saying that, I was thinking, he'd be at even him. If he didn't have the humility and the fun, that's what he'd be. No, that's I don't, true, yeah. I haven't thought about Eddie in years and years, so I don't know why he is now. You know. Oh, he passed. Eddie Van Halen passed? Mm -hmm. When was A couple of years ago, I think. Oh. Yeah. Good child, man. My bike. But yeah, I see what you're saying is that he's got the chops, oh my gosh. but he also has a vision and a personality and it's not one to be uh, haughty or stuck up or whatever. He's just I, not that guy. And I, I, I know that. Never, I hope we never find out that he's not the way we think he is. And I don't think we will. We got a little message from him. He seemed very humble. And the fact that he even knew who we were was very humble to me, humbling to me. Yeah, and I've heard people who have met him after shows and stuff, and he's not standoffish to the fans or anything. Very approachable, very nice guy. So, yeah, I believe that with um, with within my bones. <laughs> All right, I just love him. I know you do. Um, <clears throat> do you think it's time to close out? I think so. Okay, maybe we should close out with some music. If you liked our video, please give us a thumbs up. Share it with your friends. Comment down below. Hit the notification bell. I don't want notification bell on the side. No, that's a harmonica. I don't know where I had a little bell. I don't know where it went. Um, and if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider subscribing. We'd love okay. to see you. Come on in. Yeah, come on in. The water's fine. <laughs> Completely clean, no yeah. pee in it. I was trying not to say it. I couldn't help it. You, the last couple of videos, you keep talking about how warm the water is because you peed in it. No. No, we don't want to hear that. I didn't pee in it. I was just saying if you get in water and it's warm, you know somebody's peed in it. And so... I always say, come on in, the water's warm. And the saying is, come on in, the water's fine. Remember when you were a little bit, I always told you there was a chemical in the water that if you do go in the water, it would peed, show up. Yeah, it would show it, up. It, it, that's not true. No, when I was a little kid, I peed in the pool all the time. <laughs> I'll I admit could, it. <laughs> I can see that now. I just couldn't be bothered to get out because I was playing too much. <laughs> okay. Confessions of Susu. One at the end of each video. <laughs> Until we see you again, be blessed. Hey, don't hurt anybody.